When I moved to Milwaukee, I started reading pornography, going to the bookstores. Eventually that led to uh, frequenting the gay bars. When it was revealed that most of the victims were black or homosexual, people in Milwaukee were incensed. If you want to understand more about how this maniac thought, you need to know what movie was cued in his VCR player when this last victim, the survivor, arrived at his apartment. Watching the movie Exorcist 3 was also part of his ritual. It put him in the mood for murder. The cops arrested him and they asked him about the movie and why he liked it so much. This is what the police report said. I actually derives a sort of pleasure from watching that tape. Because of that, he watched The Exorcist 3 almost on a weekly basis. While the movie was playing, Dahmer would chant things under his breath, and at some point, look as though he was in a kind of trance. I felt so hopelessly uh, evil and perverted. I desensitized myself to it. I even went so far as planning on uh, setting up an altar with uh, the uh, ten different uh, skulls and skeletons. It's, it's, it's so bizarre and strange, it's hard to describe. A place where I could collect my thoughts uh, and feed my obsession. Did you like feeling evil? No. No, I didn't. But. Uh, I had tried to overcome the thoughts, and it worked for a while, but eventually I gave in. There was no use trying to fight it because I, I couldn't rid myself of it. It was, it was too powerful and persistent. Do you dislike it? Yes, it's caused a lot of problems. <laughs> 